who are we? We are Gamussel Primary School's Arts Council. Where did we go? We went to the Arts Council collection, which is on the grounds of the Yorkshire Sculpture Park. We went to Longside Gallery, where Arts Council keep their sculptures. What is the Arts Council collection? The Arts Council collection is a collection of sculptures and paintings made by artists in the UK. The Arts Council collection gave us a list of 10 artworks made by female artists and we had to choose between them. It wasn't easy. How did we research? We did a ranking order of different artworks by females. We had a big vote and whoever, whichever one had the most um, was what we were going to do. And we got to two at the top which was Calendula's cloak and this little box of sand which makes patterns. We used the iPads in the art room to research about the Calendula's cloak and Jan Howarth. Calendula's cloak is created by an amazing sculptor called Jan Howarth. Um, she's from California in the USA. What was it like seeing Calendula's cloak for the very first time? It was amazing and bright and I have never seen Calendula's cloak before so I was shocked. It is the same size as a adult. The piece of artwork has four different faces and four different seasons. For the first time it was quite a shock because I didn't think it, it would have that many bright colours. It was amazing because we only saw the pictures of it in black and white, so we hadn't seen all the colours. It was unique and I, I was glad that we chose Clendula Cluck. Clendula Cluck is called Clendula Cluck because Jan Howarth's mum's favourite flower was, Clendula, was a Clendula. Jan seems like a person who cares about her family a lot because um, in her artwork she has used incorporations of her mum's ideas and thoughts. What was your favourite part about Calendula's cloak? I liked all the bright colours. I liked it because we'd never seen it before in colour. I liked it because it was unique and different. I liked it because there was four flowers and four seasons and it made it special. I liked it because it had different faces, different hands and different seasons. It was a jaw-dropping experience. It was out of the ordinary. Um, I was um, really gobsmacked because I'd never seen it before and it was really big. Why are women sculptors important? We learn more about male sculptors because they're more popular and we can name lots of male artists. Why do we know more about male artists? We know more about male artists because in the olden days, males were more important and recognised than women. What can we do about it? I think we can help by um, telling more people about different women artists so people get inspired. We can put in exhibitions with women sculptors, paintings, and then people will be able to see them, recognise them and read more about them. This is why we need to get women sculptors to 50-50, because women should be recognised. What was your favourite bit about the trip? Seeing Calendula's cloak. Seeing Calendula's cloak for the first time. Seeing all the different bits of art. Meeting the filmer and the photographer and the curator um, because it was fantastic to ask questions about their job. Finding out all the different jobs that you could be if you worked in the Art Council collection. I really liked lunchtime because it was like a working lunch, which was really grown up. Imagining that you was the one that made Calendula's clock. 